three hearts and blue blood. They have three hearts. Two pump blood through the gills and one pumps it to the rest of the body. Their blood is blue because it uses copper-based hemocyanin to carry oxygen, which is more efficient in cold, low-oxygen water. Brainy arms. Two-thirds of an octopus's neurons are in its arms, not its central brain. This means each arm can think for itself, tasting and touching its way independently through tasks. Even a severed arm can still grasp and move. Master camouflage. They are the ultimate illusionists. Using specialized skin cells called chromatophores, iridophores, and leucophores, they can change color, pattern, and even texture in a fraction of a second to perfectly match their surroundings, whether it's coral, rock, or sand. Ink defense. Their famous ink cloud isn't just a smoke screen. It contains a compound called tyrosinase, which temporarily blinds and dulls the sense of smell of a predator, giving the octopus a crucial few seconds to jet away. Shape-shifting and mimicry. Some, like the mimic octopus, take camouflage a step further. They can contort their bodies to impersonate other, more dangerous animals like lionfish, sea snakes, or flatfish to deter predators. Short, smart lifespan. Most species have very short lifespans, often just one to three years. This makes their complex problem-solving skills, ability to learn, and even playfulness all the more remarkable. They pack a lifetime of intelligence into just a few years. The Beak of Doom Despite their soft, boneless bodies, their only hard part is a parrot-like beak. This powerful structure is made of keratin and is strong enough to crack open clams and crabs, their primary prey. Jet Propulsion They are agile swimmers thanks to jet propulsion. By rapidly expelling water from their mantle cavity through a siphon, they can shoot themselves backward at high speed to escape danger. Tool use. The veined octopus has been observed collecting discarded coconut shells, carrying them awkwardly across the seafloor, and then reassembling them to use as a portable shelter. This is a clear example of tool use in the invertebrate world. Regeneration. If an octopus loses an arm to a predator, it's not a permanent loss. They can completely regenerate a fully functional limb, complete with suckers and chromatophores without any permanent scarring. 